Hey, what's up everyone? It's your boy Pie Man, back with some exciting news. Today I've got something epic to share with you all. Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 is finally here. Yeah, you heard that right. It just dropped and we're about to dive into all the cool stuff it brings. Now, this video might be a bit raw, but I couldn't wait to get this news out to you. So without further ado, let's get into it. You know, I've been geeking out about SDXL for a while now, and we've had some fun with its previous version, but this time it's even better. Why? Because we can now run Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 with Comfy UI right in Google Colab. I mean, talk about convenience and top-notch quality. No need to mess around with downloads and installations on your local computer. We've got the setup all sorted out on the cloud. I've got a Colab script file link in the description below. Just upload it to your Google Colab account and we're ready to roll. Click on that runtime environment. Make sure to mount the drive. We need to save those amazing output images, right? And install Comfy UI. Trust me, this will be smooth as butter. Now comes the juicy part. Let's download the Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 base model and refiner model. Don't worry, I'll guide you through it step by step. It's like getting a brand new set of colors for your canvas. And believe me, this is going to take your AI art to a whole new level. When running Comfy UI in Google Colab, there are a couple of crucial steps you don't want to miss to ensure smooth sailing with Stable Diffusion XL 1.0. Let's break it down step by step. Firstly, remember to change the runtime type to GPU. This is essential because Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 benefits significantly from the accelerated processing power of GPUs, allowing you to generate stunning images faster and with greater efficiency. Next, don't forget to uncomment the lines that involve downloading the SDXL 1.0 base model and refiner model. This is critical for ensuring that you have access to the latest and most advanced AI models to create high-quality artwork. So, look for those lines in the Colab script and make sure they are uncommented to enable the download of these powerful models. By following these steps, you'll be unleashing the true potential of Comfy UI and Stable Diffusion XL 1.0, creating breathtaking AI art like never before. So, get those GPUs fired up. I know, I know. You've been waiting for this moment. We're running Comfy UI with a local tunnel and I'll show you exactly how to get that magic link. Once we've got that link, we'll enter the endpoint IP, don't confuse it with your computer IP, and boom, the comfy UI web interface pops up with a super cool node-based workflow diagram. Prepare to be amazed. All right, it's time to put Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 to the test. We'll load up the checkpoint node and select SDI SXL 1.0. Now get ready, because the first run might take a little while for the initial setup. Don't panic, it's all part of the process. Oh, and just wait until you see the results. A clear glass bottle? Beautiful. Let's move on to Iron Man. Paint art style. Nailed it. Realistic style. Oh, yeah. Oh, and here's another cool thing about Stable Diffusion XL 1.0. It's not just about creating incredible images for free, but you can also experiment with generating restricted photos. Yeah, that's right. With this powerful tool, you can unlock a whole new world of creativity and push the boundaries of what's possible. Imagine turning ordinary photos into mind-bending, surreal masterpieces that leave everyone in awe. It's like giving your art superpowers. So if you're ready to unleash your creativity and break free from restrictions, Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 is the way to go. And there you have it, folks. Stable Diffusion XL 1.0 with Comfy UI in Google Colab. It's that simple. No hassles, no downloads, just pure creativity. Now, I want to hear from you. What do you think about the new Stable Diffusion XL 1.0? Tell me in the comments below. And if you love this video, smash that thumbs up. And hey, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more mind-blowing content on all kinds of generative AE and AI tools. Until next time, keep creating and I'll catch you in the next video.